Okay, we haven't been in this hive for about two weeks. I did some work on the other hive with the missing queen. We're gonna check on them and see if they've come back to life. But it's been a while since we've been in here. Let's start with the 3D printed hive. I'm gonna finish messing with my coat. Here. We just had a bunch of rain come through. And we're working on warming this up. So if we get any more rain, we're gonna be have a hasty retreat. But it's supposed to be good at this point. So says the weather map. Try to be nice. A little smoke on the entrance. That's not too bad. A little smoke in the hole. Okay. We're coming up the top. Not such bad. It's looking good. Let's pull out one of these end frames. Couple bees on it. Nothing must to mention. That one's totally undone. This one has some comb that they're making full of some nectar. Oh, calm the bees down. This one. This side we got comb. That side we got comb, nectar, and pollen. There. Working their bee butts off. Next. We have capped brood. We have drones. We have a bunch of pollen. See on this side we got capped brood, a bunch of larvae. Take into this three frame really nice, deep and a half. Taking a moment to see if I can see the queen, and I don't. But that's okay. I already know that she's doing a good job. We have. Brood. We have nectar. We have pollen. Put the side. Cap brood, a couple larvae. I know. You guys are doing great. Ooh, nice and heavy. Got brood, larva, drones. Ooh, that's a colder breeze. 
reason I like for that. A little wonky on their comb here. Looks like some of it pulled off on this frame in here. Let's take a look at that real quick. We have cap brood, we have capped honey. Right here, a little bit of burr comb got started. I'm gonna have to do a little something about that. Take that right off. Looks like the side of the 3D printed hive didn't go in completely. And here we got some capped honey, bees working, and the final frame, nothing really going on. Let's put these back together. Close this up. They are doing quite well. They seem happy with their space. They seem happy with their hive. Got those a little closer together. Looks like there were a couple things getting ready to hatch on that burr comb. breeze blows. Oh my. Get in there. Just try to put a lid on that. Those bees from they shouldn't be. I'm gonna set this right there. See if they can do any cleanups if they want to. And the strong hive is strong. Let's go check the other. Come with me. Come with me. I've seen hiding her hair of any bees while it was setting up. Oop, I need more honey. All right. What do we got here? off ants lots of ants I don't like lots of ants about a week ago I dropped a new queen in here I have to get my tool again. And there are some bees. That's a good start. Better than a dead hive. We have a lot of ants in this hive. Take a look here. 
Nance, we got some nectar. We have a cluster of bees. They're larva. Looks like drones. Couple cap larva. And some nectar. Oh, they're doing really bad, aren't they? Cockroach. These bees are not strong. So what I'm gonna do, I'm taking some bees from the other hive. I don't see that I get a lot of choice here. If I can shake some frames, of course, to do this, I gotta be sure where that queen is. So let's work on that. Can you bees? Hey, some of you guys stay. Probably the only chance these guys have. Yeah, it looks like at least some of them were okay with it. Some of those looked young. 
Hopefully they'll stay. This hog should really be doing better. We'll see if that gives them any boost. It's been. about a week so the fact that I saw something laid in there and she's at least doing something it's not a lot of bees to take care of them hopefully a little bit more care goes a little ways and we come back in a week or two and have a little strength to the hive not we'll try some more shake some more bees in if that doesn't do anything we might end up having to redo this hive didn't see the queen but I saw signs of her they're really not in great shape for me to keep them open too long so that's it I'll put the straps on and we're done <laughs>